Hello everyone, welcome to the greenhouse. I'm Danny. I hope this video finds you guys well today. Today I want to show you the top three most fragranced Phalaenopsis in bloom right now. And I'm going to go from least to the most fragrant and least to my most favorite. <laughs> and I am not the best at describing scents, so I'm going to try my best and hopefully convey to you the best I can what they smell like. Third place was a toss-up between this beauty here. Isn't it gorgeous? Look at the cute flower pot. Between that one and this one from Big Leaf Orchids. And I ended up going with this one because the fragrance is just a tad smidge bit stronger, but it has a more beautiful fragrance. It's fruity. I don't detect any cinnamon. It's just very fruity and fresh. And I got this from Big Leaf Orchids. It's getting another flower spike right there, but this bloom is very thick. The petals are very thick and waxy and it's been in bloom for over a month now. And let me show you the ID really quick. So I told you it's from Big Leaf Orchids and there's the ID in case you want it. It was a very reasonable price. I think it was $38. So that is number three. Number two might surprise you because it is a no ID mini fowl from a grocery store. Does this bloom, do these blooms look familiar? These are the same blooms. This is the orchid that I have as my YouTube profile picture and my Instagram picture. I love yellow and it's just like, it's perfect, perfect summertime colors, but it's a very strong fragrance of candy. Not like Jolly Ranchers, but more like Starburst. Like if you had a huge bag of Starburst, Starburst candy that has already been unwrapped and you stuck your nose in it, that's what this smells like. It's gonna be time for a repot soon. You can see she made her way over to the side of the pot right there. We need to get some fresh media in there and give her a nice new setup. But it has just gorgeous, gorgeous blooms along with a gorgeous fragrance. The number one spot was a very, very easy pick. I knew exactly which orchid it was gonna be. And this orchid smells up the greenhouse from morning till about three, four o'clock in the evening. And it's this beauty right here. And it smells of cinnamon. Not artificial cinnamon either, but just a beautiful, beautiful cinnamon dough, like a cinnamon donut. Have you ever gotten one of those twisted donuts that's just coated in cinnamon and sugar, but it's still warm and it's baked fresh. That's exactly what these blooms smell like. A cinnamon donut. And you, I don't know if you've ever smelt a flower of a Phalaenopsis that smells like Big Red, the chewing gum. That's not what this smells like at all. It has a doughy fragrance in the background. And I just love the shape and the purple. Now this is from orchids.com and here's the ID. I love this little orchid. It hangs like that from my shelf and it gets lots and lots of light. And it's a definitely must have for its color and its fragrance. I hope you guys enjoyed that and I hope you guys we're able to get a little bit of idea of how the fragrance smells and how I pick it up. And I hope I was able to describe it well enough to you. 
happy growing everybody stay safe till next time